Good evening, I'm Karen Larson with 2 News Oklahoma with the latest on that active shooter situation that happened in South Tulsa this evening. Tulsa police say they got a call around 453 that there were shots in the Natalie building, an active shooter inside the building. Tulsa police say within three minutes, officers had responded. And when minutes after that, when they heard shots being fired, they went to the second floor and that is where they encountered the gunman and four civilians. In all, four civilians were killed. The gunman, Tulsa police say, died of a self-inflicted gunshot wound. We do not have an identification yet on this man. However, they say that it is a black man, 35 to 40 years old, who was carrying one rifle and a handgun, and both were apparently fired on the scene. Tulsa police SWAT team also responded. Their special operations team immediately rushing in and clearing the Natalie building. This is occurring at the Natalie building complex, which is on the St. Francis Health System campus just south of the hospital itself. Detectives are spending this evening interviewing witnesses from the second floor as well as others who are around the building. Families of those who may have been involved have been told to go to Memorial High School at 58th and South Hudson where they will be reunited or given information about what is happening. The officers say that multiple law enforcement agencies responded immediately to the scene, including federal partners such as the FBI, Tulsa police, massive response there, Tulsa Sheriff, Lighthorse Police, OHP, as well as FBI. Now, we are obviously sent four different crews who are on the scene right now gathering more information for you. We are actively going to be covering this through the evening on all of our social media platforms, as well as live on 2 News Oklahoma at 10 tonight and first thing in the morning. We'll see you here at 10.